Hello guys and welcome back to my channel Firewall again. In the last video we have seen, uh, I mean in last troubleshooting video we have seen how to, uh, you know, get rid of the licensing error, but uh, still we were facing some issues. So in this video I'm trying to resolve that part. So what I was thinking, uh, the way I was importing licenses into the gateway was correct. But the thing was, uh, I was importing the license for the security management servers and that is not relevant for the gateways. That one thing came in my mind. So in this video, I'm trying to, uh, to you know, uh, import a proper licenses. So let's see if that works. So if you go to the checkpoint firewall side, you have something called product evolution. <coughs> Come here and try to do uh, the steps what I'm doing. So first, all-in-one license you need to have for the SMS. So uh, you can do it like this, give it your account number, give the IP address of your uh, SMS or security manager server, 192.168.1.100. One uh, the purpose is evaluation purpose. Get evaluation. So let's wait a couple of minutes to get this uh, uh, license get generated. Meanwhile, let me re-log into my SMS. Uh, let me close what I have so far open. So let's go to the <coughs> SMS smart dashboard. Evolution license expired. Cool. That is fine. We will put the license to CLI. Uh, now go back to your evaluation product license and here view the evaluation directly product center, click here and if you want license file you can copy from here so the file got generated and I believe uh, you will be having the license file detail on your email ID as well So this is the latest file uh, with the IP address what we have, which is okay. So just you have to copy paste uh, detail from here. So from the CLI you can, you know, I mean from the CLI you can import a license. Let me go ahead. And put the license that is here. And let me now log into the SMS. It should give me, it should be able, I should be able to log in. Or maybe I need to restart. Okay, it's getting initialized. So this part is done. 
for the SMS. Let me close this. Now, again, go back to the evaluation page, and here you have to generate a license for the gateways. So, go back to the product evaluation. <coughs> and for the gateway, you have to select this option select your product. So, I'll be selecting uh, quantum printer, all software, blades, evaluation, CPSG evaluation. Uh, mobile access get unlimited number of quantum users. Carrier quantum evaluation, CPSG carrier evaluation. Uh, so let's go for I think let's try one by one. Let's try with this next. Give your account details, purpose, <laughs> get your addition. Meanwhile, let's go to your smart update. So I think the evaluation got generated. Let's do one more time. So we need to have one more license here. So select the same. What happened? Okay, uh, this is best. That is fine. Uh, okay, go back here. Wait the evolution. If you see to view the evaluation directly in product center, you have to click here. And if you go back to the evaluation page or evaluation tab, uh, you will see the details, uh, license information, product information. So right now we need to have, let's see what we got. Product history, that is my license information. So this carrier will be having these all things. Let's try this one. Let me get one license and give it an IP address 192.16 of your gateway 192.168.1.101. Hardware brand is your checkpoint. We don't have anything for the open server, so for now I'm selecting checkpoint, Gaia operating systems. Rest are same, click license. And we get the license file. Let's see. So number 14. Let's import it first. So right now we don't have any license. Uh, package. No, sorry. License contract. Add file. From file. And we need to add number 14. Okay. So if you can see, it's still valid. Mars 26 and if I say gateway one sorry license okay I can see the licenses got added and I think SMS is also there but let me see get license yeah for both the license got added let's do it for gateway two let me go to here back to products uh, click evolution to license this 
let me I think we need to have relevant to one. This one. Okay, so it's the same one we're talking about. So let's select license. Give it a IP address 192.168.1.10.110. Uh, select the hardware brand, checkpoint, rest of the things like this. And once you click license, the license will get generated. Define. Now go back to your SMS so, uh, smart update and import this license. Okay. So gateway two also having the license now. Now let's go back to your gateway and try to install policy. Let's see this time we will be able to install policy or not. So it's basically again giving the same error that no valid license. Let's try one more thing here. Let's go back to the product evolution. Select the product. Let's see. This license select next. <laughs> so we have selected this one. Let me quickly detach these licenses, at least for from the gateway. And now let's try to import the newer version of the license. This is what I'm suspecting uh, of my gateway, whichever I have installed, they are not complying with the licenses what I am importing. That's the only issue. Rest of the things are fine. The steps what I am performing will be relevant for you, for your lab purpose. So, uh, Let's go to the um, let me close this evolution total licenses or that what in license while licenses. All in one security evaluation license. Uh, this is what I have just, I think, downloaded. Let's go for it now. So let's do it at the address one zero one. 
let's go back one more time i just want to confirm because we are not importing the same license again and again so this is what are the one uh, i'm talking about more no support for this one that is fine Let me close this evolution. I don't know the licenses. All in one evolution bundle. This guy. Let me go to the licensing page. Okay, this one. I think we already delivered this work. That's why it's showing that. Uh, which one we just recently captured? Let me go to that license. Third invalid licenses. Today's date. Uh, okay. Okay, this one we just have uh, issued date 26 March is I think today. Content to echo. I think this one. So, uh, let's go for it. Let's try to install this. Uh, let's see if it works. Let's generate the same for your one one zero gateway. So let me go back to product evolution. If you I want to select this guy <laughs> next. Go to the product center. Let's wait. Let's go into the product information. And I think this is the one we are talking about. So let's go for the license. Your IP address 182.168.1.110. Your operating system or your product will be the checkpoint. The rest of the information are the same. And then try to get the license file. Go to the SMS and again import the license file.
so this license got imported now let's try to install the policy i hope this time it will work if not uh, the steps are the same you just have to uh, pick up the valid license for you and install it and whatever the licensing error you are facing will be get rid of This is what I'm ex I, I think I'm getting. The whatever license I'm importing is not uh, suitable for my environment. That's why I'm getting this error. But uh, the steps are the same, and you can refer the same steps. And I will try to you know uh, see the valid license for my environment, and uh, from there we'll uh, talk about the you know next sort of errors. Uh, for the licensing, uh, this is the entire video tutorials, guys. So refer part one and part two, and uh, get it going. Thanks for watching this video, and have a good day.